Is the Monday application the best app for product management into the 2024? Let's find out today. Welcome back to Zexpress. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to break down the features, limitations, and overall value to determine mind if this is the best free product management tool available today. So guys, to get started, first of all, let's talk about Monday.com. So Monday.com is an actual bureaucratic product management platform known for its user-friendly and powerful customization options. So the free plan is designed to help individuals and small teams manage the projects without the healthy investment. Now, what is the actual key features of the free plan? Now, the free plan, of course, comes with different small teams for solo entrepreneurs. If you have user to access to unlimited boards and over 200 templates, making it easy to get started on any project, then I believe that the best tool for people who have small projects or only for yourself should be more than enough. Speaking about the limitations of the free plan, the free plan offers a lot. There's so much limitation. It doesn't include the banned features uh, like time tracking, of course. Uh, we can add a limited people of the team. There's available into the pay plans, of course, additional customer support for free. But of course, there are a few elements that need to be like set it up when you're just getting started here inside the actual monday.com so comparing this with the actual competitors speaking about how does the actual interface works i believe like it's going to be really really easy to create tables to create project management is like too easy to get started with monday working management now the actual plan that the actual free plan gives you less than the basic for example there is only five seat here into items you have less than two thousand here into limited boats, you don't have unlimited boats. You only have up to five boats. There is a file storage up to one gigabyte, an active login, iOS application, of course, free BIOS, of course, white book collaboration. This is not enabled. And beam document not enabled, can be enabled, and that would be actually it. There's nothing else that we can add directly inside the actual Monday.com. And when you get started with the very first part of Monday.com, this actually gives you an actual free 14 day free trial of the pro plan. So if you choose to get started with an actual basic standard plan, pro plan, whatever, it's going to be helping you just to merge absolutely everything directly into Monday. If you actually just buy, if you're just passing by and use the Monday.com application with the actual free trial, automatically you might be needing to upgrade it into the pro element, which is the actual current trial that we are actually using. We cannot downgrade from one free trial into another one. We're only able to use an actual pro plan and that will be actually it. And if you focused after the actual 14 days late into the free trial, the actual application won't let you sign in until you pay for the current line that you're actually having into your free trial. That means that if you are not willing to continue with this actual pro plan and you want to downgrade into a free plan, then everything that everything that you have into your workspace, all those elements, all those pro plans should be deleted automatically. All the integrations, all the filters, absolutely everything inside Monday.com. That's the reason why we don't like a lot this free trial that by default were created when just getting started here into Monday. That's another and huge con when it comes to creating and starting here into Monday. So if you're okay, if you think that you are ready to get started here into Monday, I can assure you that the best tool to get started, it's not from a 14 day trial, is to go straight forward directly into a basic plan. So who should you use Monday free plan? Well, the Monday.com free plan is ideal for individuals or small team. We just talked about starting for the product management tools and those who prioritize organization and task uh, management without the need to complex workflows, actually, because we only need the actual new, in this case, what I do is to only use the Kanban view, for example, or the main table. But there are a few elements that are only available into this new basic plan, for example. So make sure that you can just use one table at a time when you're getting started here into the integration. So it's also great for those who wanted to test the waters of the Monday.com interface with features before committing to a paid subscription. But I can totally assure you, if you're willing to work with an actual free plan, 
uh, let's say like a test mode, I believe that you won't be encouraged to pay like yes or yes into this new plan because all those elements should be deleted after the 14 day trial and that's something that's really really huge and annoying so monday.com is the best free product management tool for 2024 i can certainly tell you that it offers a rubber set of features for free users what we actually don't like is the actual commitment of the trial version so if you wanted to stick around with the free plan and you wanted to go downgrade for the free plan it says you still have 14 days on the april trial enjoy at the end you can choose your favorite plan but after that you're willing to renew it or to choose an actual plan paid plan so that's the reason why we don't like a lot the free plan there's other options like notion there's azana there's the workflow and there's so much more elements so speaking about monday i believe like the basic plan is really great and i believe it's really great and affordable but speaking about an actual free trial rather than using a free plan it's really really difficult to try it out an actual free plan and stick around to it so guys, hopefully this information was really useful for you. You can try it out by yourself and see how what happens after your 14 days left. And you might be noticing what I'm actually talking about, guys. So if you enjoyed this review and want to more tech insight, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share to this new video. Thank you so much for watching the video, guys. Hopefully with all of that being said, we continue to the broad new section of TechPress. See you next time.